Seattle Public Schools is making changes to support LGBTQ plus students. Cairo 7's Tracy Leong spoke to the school board president about a resolution to add inclusive curriculum as well as gender neutral bathrooms. As the first open queer person elected and the first open queer person as president, I think it was really important for me. Seattle School Board President Zachary DeWolf says the school district's plan creates a welcoming environment for everyone. Students are not just a reflection of the world, but a reflection. Of the, the world is a reflection of our students, and we need to catch up to them in this moment. Passed at the end of Pride Month, the resolution reflects the district's commitment to inclusion. Curriculum will now include LGBTQ history and culture. It needs to be a mirror for young folks to, to say that your community, if you're queer, has always been resilient. Here's the stories of struggle, and here's how they came out of it, and here's how we're stronger for it. I would have been grateful to have something like this as a young kid. And I will say, I think it built up my resilience, um, particularly as a queer Native student when I went to public schools. So, you know, I wouldn't change my story, but I imagine it would have added uh, certainly something very positive to my experience. The district will also include gender neutral bathrooms at all 104 schools and new school construction moving forward. Many Seattle public schools have already adopted this policy, including Nathan Hale High School. SBS will continue to honor and respect the self reported identity and sexual orientation of students and staff, adding they will never be disciplined for speaking openly. Plus, they'll rename a school to honor a local or national LGBTQ hero. Young people, particularly LGBTQ students, families and educators, want to see someone from their community uh, memorialize uh, for the great work that they've done to advance our rights. Tracy Leong, Cairo 7 News.